Hello, welcome to Silavi Tarot. Let's take a look and see what this person is feeling today. That one person that's on your mind, that person that you're thinking about. All right, whenever you watch this, this is for you, of course. And let's take a look. Before we start again, please, if you would like a personal reading, everything is below in the description box below. How is this person feeling about my viewers at this time? How is this person truly feeling about my viewers at this time? What is this person's energy towards my viewers? Mm -hmm. I've been thinking about you. So this is someone here that is trying to find a different way or a different strategy to try to approach you here okay so i do feel like you're definitely on this person's mind with the four swords here this person could have been on vacation or this person's returning on vacation or that's something that you two are planning someone here is going on vacation there's something about a vacation here that's happening or someone here is possibly at a pool or this person's out and about and i see this person heavily thinking about you OK, I do feel like this person, even on their day off or whatever it is, however they lounge around, I feel like this person has been thinking about you. It's as if they have taken a break or this person decided to pull back from things for a minute just to sort of regroup. Right. We have the magician energy here. Very beautifully, some of you could be dating someone or connecting with someone um, that again at this time they're trying to find a way to approach you it's like i'm trying to find the courage to say something so we can actually have a conversation or we could actually go back to where things started now with the knight of wands here this is someone here a lot of you may view as questionable and what i mean by that is with the magician energy there it's as if you're not sure what this person's plans are okay you're not sure why this person is being so on and off or you're not sure why this person's using certain um you know vibrations when they talk to you it's like i don't understand this person okay now what i will say for you i do feel like at some point this person definitely felt overwhelmed at some point we do have a very overwhelming energy and of course that's just coming from a place of i don't know what the next step should be or what the next step is going to be so i felt like someone here decided to withdraw or they uh, decided to pull back for a little bit now I get the vibe that this is temporary, okay? For a lot of you, you're asking yourself, well, should I move on? Should I stay? What's going on with this person? They seem to be very happy without me. They seem to not even be really concerned about this connection to some degree. But I will say someone here is definitely planning, okay? Using some of their tools and tactics to get back into your life. Now, for some of you, this is something that you should be cautious about, okay? I'm getting like someone here... It's interesting if this is someone here that wears like hair ties or hair bands or something of that nature. This person has a very distinct look to them. OK, this person could be from like the Middle East or this person just has that exotic look to some degree. But again, I'm just getting the vibe that this person's trying to find a different way into your life. And again, for some of you, it's like, well, this person always does this. Well, this is what this person's thinking about currently now. Also in the current energy, we have a very, very loving energy, okay? I feel like this person struggles at times with communicating, struggles with actually letting you know how they feel about you. And I feel like as time goes on, this person's going to realize like, hey, look, I actually want to, you know, invest in this or I actually want to grow, um, grow, I don't want to say old, but I feel like this person just wants to have long term with you here. Again, there's like this difference between you two here. OK, it could just be in culture, complexion, energy, whatever it is, there's some sort of difference here where it's like we're trying to come together. Either we have children and we're trying to come together or we're living in different states or different cities and we're trying to come together. There's something about differences here that could have played a role to some degree where you questioned it and you said, hey, you know, am I someone that you actually see long term with now? With the Tower energy and the Knight of Swords poking out there, I do feel like a lot of you are going to be very surprised by some sort of action that this person's going to take. Whether the action is coming to see you, having a conversation with you, expressing to you how they feel, 
Okay, telling you that, hey, look, I actually have very strong emotions and feelings for you and I would love to grow into a place of uh, commitment with you here. So someone here, they're moving from this confusion spot into a place where they're surprising themselves and you and actually wanting to move forward. As you could see, this person comes in extremely, extremely fast. It's as if this person wants to be honest with you, okay? I want to be honest with you. I want to tell you exactly how I feel. Okay, whatever yellow may mean to you, if that's your favorite color or that's something that you have a lot around. Okay, I'm just getting a lot of yellow here, which for me is just growth. Um, I still see growth for a lot of you within this connection with the Ace of Cups just sitting there. This is someone that, you know, uh, you're going to go out for drinks with. You're going to have a glass of wine with or that's something you just like to do. But either way here, there is some sort of new offer, new beginning. And I feel like this person wants to pour into your cup. It's like, finally pour into my cup. And it's so interesting. Look at all of this communication. Communication after some sort of, you know, hurt to some degree or after some sort of disappointment. Um, I do see this person. It's as if they're pulling you back in, as you could see. I would love to communicate with you. And a lot of you, again, it's going to catch you by surprise. Okay, it's going to catch you by surprise. You're going to feel very shocked by this person's energy. Um, it's like this person really started feeling you pulling back or this person started to realize that they were losing you um, and their confusion was really causing some sort of distance or this confusion energy started creating some obstacles in the connection. Um, now, I feel like with the Seven of Cups, this is someone here that is like terminating some of their options. Like I no longer want to, um, you know, speak to multiple, you know, different people and I actually want to focus on this relationship. For a lot of you, something here in this person's background is not working any longer. It could be their lies. It could be their tactic. It could be, um, you know, a connection that they were part of. It's no longer working for them. And now this person's coming in wanting to have a new beginning with you. Okay. And I do feel like for some of you, you may just be focusing on traveling right now. It's like while you're traveling or while you're really just focusing on you, this is when this person comes in. All right. I do feel like there is an apology that needs to happen after someone here has been quiet for some time. Okay. There was some sort of fear. It's like, I'm afraid of, you know, coming towards you and apologizing or addressing something here that took place between us. Hmm. Okay, some of you feel like this person's very secretive, like you're not really being expressive, you're not really, you know, enlightening me and telling me exactly what's going on in your life. And I feel like, again, this person also um, is in a place where they're going through a lot in the background, so, especially with self esteem issues I'm getting here, um, insecurity issues. I feel like this person has been dealing with and trying to address that to some degree, but I feel like there's a lot of hurt that this person has been concealing from you, hence, which you know, contributed to some sort of long pause that you two um, were experiencing within this connection. Let's get some more energies here. So, a lot of you here, communication definitely coming in, okay. And I feel like you're just at a point where you're just saying, well, I thought this was over. I thought this person was living their best life. They're at parties, you know, which is fine. But I feel like a lot of you just felt like this person completely forgot about you. Let your friends help you. All right. What are the messages here for my viewers? Okay. We have very soon, as I stated. Okay. There's communication coming in very soon. There's contact coming in very soon. There is a love offer coming in extremely soon here. It says clearly decide what you want so that when it comes to you, you'll know what to do with it. Okay. Um, be sure to know that you want this person. All right. For a lot of you, it's like, I want this person for different reasons. You know, whether it's, you know, just to get back into a relationship with this person or just to get some sort of closure. I feel like this person is going to come back here into your energy. Some of you, this could be you communicating with this person. And the minute that you communicate with this person, um, there's a very strong, deep conversation that happens that actually starts a new journey. So take it how it resonates. We also have engagement here. Okay, your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment, as we stated prior. Okay, I will talk to you soon. Of course, I hope this resonated for you. Uh, good luck on this journey, and I will talk to you soon. Have a very, very beautiful week.